Guys, I'm so freaking excited because we actually have a sponsor for today's vlog. Huge shout out to Furbo for sponsoring. I've literally wanted one of their dog cameras for the longest time. So Furbo is the number one interactive dog camera that is out there. It's a camera that lets you see, talk, and toss treats to your dog from literally anywhere, even if you're not home. It has a full HD camera. You can talk two ways to your dog, and you can also throw the treats, which is so awesome. And honestly, my favorite part about it is the fact that you get real-time updates on your dog. There's also additional features you can get, like the Furbo Dog Nanny, which is really cool because it's literally like having an actual nanny or dog sitter being with your dog but while you're out and about and what's freaking dope is the camera can tell a difference between a human and a dog so you're not going to get all these unnecessary alerts to your phone so yeah i'm going to talk about it way more in the video later we had way too much fun playing with it um so definitely check it out link in the description box and again huge huge shout out to them enjoy the video guys um and yeah Wow, my heart is so full. Aesthetic. Oh, hey, everyone's calling me out. I'm all about the blue box. It's gonna be a good day. We're healthy too, like what? Just like my ish, you know what I mean? Oh my God, who got the chips ahoy? You guys are going to die. Okay. Oh, this is so dope. <laughs> it's just, it's so cute. <laughs> my heart is full. Good morning, everyone. We are making some protein pancakes this morning because I wanted to. <laughs> no idea how I look right now, but you guys need to try this. They're basically just like healthy protein pancakes and all that I put in here is a banana, very ripe. Like if you have a ripe banana, it's better. Two eggs, a little bit of water. I use the Flavor God chocolate donut seasoning. I put a little bit of cinnamon and then I also just put like a splash of vanilla. And you can totally like end at that, but I also put like just the tiniest bit of vanilla protein powder to kind of make them a little more fluffy. We're just gonna blend this up. And you don't need to do it long. Just enough to like mix it all up. Then, while the pan's heating up, I have blueberries, almond butter, batter, and then I'm also gonna get some honey out as well as some cocoa powder. Boom, station is ready. I'm so excited. I've never actually done these with blueberries and I forgot that we had them, so I got so freaking stoked to eat them. Also, yes, it is 11.37. I slept freaking in this morning and it felt so good. I slept until 10, which is kind of unheard of for me, so very excited. Okay, boom. Oh my God. My biggest tip, honestly, is they're not normal pancakes. You can't treat them like regular pancakes. So you really can't flip it too early. So like, let it sit. Don't flip it too early because otherwise it's just gonna get all messy and it'll not work, trust me. I'm also catching up on Rem's vlogs. It's so weird that she's moved and I haven't even been to her house. Like it's insane to me. It's so crazy. Okay, I don't know if they look that appetizing, but it's kind of a little more like a mush. I'm just gonna add some honey to it and ooh, it's gonna be so good. I have a call with my manager right now, so I'm going to do that while I eat and I'm freaking stoked. We're just gonna drizzle. Okay, call went good, and then I realized I never even explained how I like finished these. I don't know if you guys care, but they look kind of like mush and burnt, but I swear. Oh my God, I already ate like half of it. Afterwards, I like put a thin layer of almond butter all on the top, and then I sprinkled the cocoa powder, and then you drizzled the honey. Oh my God, so good. This is my first time with blueberries, but normally I'll do like some dates, or you can do more banana. It's so good. They're healthy too, like what? It's gonna be a good day. <laughs> Oh my God, the sun is finally starting to peek out and it looks so pretty outside. So we're gonna get ready. Okay, I like quickly pin my hair, throwing on some makeup. Then we can start our day. Guys, my lash extensions are like hanging on by a thread, like literally, oof. And then last night I looked down and I realized I literally have like a whole section of this nail missing now. So I need to figure out what I'm gonna do. I need to figure out if I'm just gonna trim them, if I'm gonna try to do a fill myself. I don't know, let's get dressed. Also, I have a package coming today. I think that I'm so freaking excited for. You guys are going to die. I've always wanted one, never have had one, but it's coming today and I'm freaking stoked. You know what else I'm stoked for? So my vlog yesterday, I did a small little haul and dolls Kelsey over some stuff. I'm sorry, but how freaking cute are these joggers? We love a bedazzle moment. They're by Poster Girl, if you're wondering. I'm gonna have them linked down below if you guys want them. Almost got a large, but then I felt like an extra large would be better just because I really love my sweatpants baggy. Literally, I always have them like so big, especially when you just want them for like lounging around the house. I will say, 
you can smell the glue that they use pretty strong so if that bothers you like don't get these i'm hoping because they're brand new like after a day or two they'll kind of like not smell as strong it's not that bad like i'm still gonna wear it but for anyone who has like really sensitive to that kind of stuff just be aware of that but yes okay i'm kind of obsessed with my outfit today i literally said in yesterday's vlog that this is what i wanted to wear today and i am obsessed with it i need to tighten the strap still but the top is the like airbrush one that says dream in the freaking joggers are like all bedazzled i feel like my inner childhood self is just dying because like literally could not afford limited to like I was not trendy like I was not that like girl that everyone wanted to be in elementary school oh my god so cute okay also like literally just PSA <laughs> I have this freaking like rash bump thing so like I've had it for like weeks and it's been annoying me but it's finally getting better thank the lord so I put some cream on it so that's what that is please don't look at it please don't judge me please don't anything because it's a sensitive topic <laughs> ew okay TMI anyways was I record oh I was recording good I think we're gonna go make some coffee right now because it sounds great why not also we just got some groceries so I feel like we should do a grocery haul for you guys. Ashley's about to film. Got a package from Sunday Riley. Yes. Oh, oh my God. Are Excuse you crying? Me? No. Oh. <laughs> I thought they you were actually me and they were like, oh, we'd love to send you some goodies. And I sent them a picture of my empty good jeans bottle and was like, the timing. <laughs> Wait, you look cute today. Yeah. Thanks. She got ready or whatever. I got ready. I did my makeup and I was going to do my hair, but it was gross. So we're going to I literally just put pins in my hair. I didn't even do anything I'm to so it. Somehow I slept not crazy because it's like I haven't tried this I'm guessing this is similar to the old Henriksen like brightening oh uh, I have the true serum I guess I need to do another skincare routine Ooh. oh my god Cleansing balm <laughs> I love the word balm 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 okay grocery mother freaking haul Okay, so we actually had a grocery delivery, which I don't know about you guys. I'm so paranoid about going out and stuff. I literally haven't even left the house and I think it's day 12. Barely have like stepped outside, which I probably should do that more, but I haven't even like gone anywhere. I'm just really trying to like do my freaking part. We actually found so many delivery services, which I think is so awesome. Cause obviously in here in LA, like there's Postmates and there's DoorDash and all that stuff. But like even my parents were able to find a delivery place where they're from and they don't have Postmates. Like they don't have normal like delivery like most of LA does. So I think it's been really cool seeing what stores are like able to do that. So like definitely check it out in your area if you're scared about leaving the house and stuff And then we ended up just ordering this from a local grocery store. This whole thing is just so weird Anyways, since you know, we are really not trying to be on our bikini game or season or anything like that We got some fun things. So we got some healthy stuff. We got some produce. I'm gonna go through it so freaking quick we got some popcorn. Also got some Oreos. Not only just Oreos, we got the double stuffed Oreos. They're great to have. Alicia's like, we're going at it. The other fun food that I got was Lucky Charms because if you know anything about me, you know that this is my favorite like sugary cereal. That and Strawberry Special K, just like my ish. You know what I mean? Like we got that. Still trying to be healthy, but like I think these snacks are nice. You know, nice little like cereal moment. Eggs, we've been going through spinach like crazy. So we got some spinach and then we also got romaine. What else do we got? TK really wanted some macaroni and cheese and I just have to say the craft kind is the absolute best kind. Ashley likes the nasty Velveeta kind. <laughs> I'm all about the blue box. That's all I gotta say. We also got some bell peppers, more bananas. We've been going through those like crazy too. Avocados, apples and tomatoes, some pepperoncinis, also dates. Love the freaking dates. Oh my God, who got the Chips Ahoy? I didn't get the Chips Ahoy. Maybe I accidentally added it when I was trying to do Oreos. Oh, well, either way. I didn't. <laughs> I ordered Oreos for a snack. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, my fruit. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, that's pretty much everything that we got. While they're taking a small filming break, I'm gonna make my coffee. Or at least try to. Fine, I'll wait, I'll wait. <laughs> Not that big of a priority. Also, welcome to quarantine day 11. It is my favorite number. Yeah. Two sets. Even if I just do it like between your breaks. Ooh, what kind of cup do we want? Do I want to be trendy and have like a mason jar moment? Yes. But is that enough coffee for me? No. No, exactly. <laughs> hmm. Hey, we're going with the trendy mason jar. Oh my God, thank God. Yesterday we had no ice. It's all the smoothies we're making. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna have some oat milk in this ish today. I can tell someone just threw these in here instead of putting them perfectly organized like Aww. I spent so much time on. I had to edit someone's video. <laughs> Shots fire! It's fine, I'll just color code them myself. I'll color code them in a vlog. <laughs> just kidding. 
know I was giving you a vlog title. We're in a fight. First roommate fight. Da 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 da. I don't even know vanilla. which one. Is. The vanilla. Is there dairy in it though? I don't know. I need, I need to look. I need to look it up. I'm gonna go. You actually know they're vegan. They're vegan, bitch. Oh yeah. <laughs> Okay, everyone's calling me out. I got those snacks. I got those snacks because we might film a video. I feel like they'll be excited. I feel like they'll be stoked. If it happens, I just don't want to get their hopes up and then me not do it. Cause no, then, we'll do then, it. I, then I'll let them down. Do you want me to look up to see if there's dairy in the vanilla? Can you actually though? Yes, gotcha. <laughs> It's always so hard picking an espresso pod because some have like 10 for caffeination and some have like a four, but I want like a solid five. Okay, I'm gonna do grain. Oh. Update, all espresso pods are vegan. At least I think don't come at me, look for yourself. <laughs> oh my God, this looks so good. Oh, I think I put too much ice. Huh. Wow, aesthetic. <laughs> okay, I'm getting some work done. I'm very excited to have this. We just got some lunch. Honestly, I am starving and I'm very excited to eat this. So, mm. Mm, 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 mm. best broccoli of life. You guys, my package came. I'm so excited. Did I tell you what I got? No. <laughs> So as you guys saw earlier in this video, this video is actually sponsored by Furbo and they sent me a freaking Furbo. I have genuinely always wanted one. Remy actually has one and it's always fun seeing her like toss treats to Daisy anytime me and her are out and about or something. She'll be like, oh, let's check on Daisy, which is her dog. It honestly was always just so fun being able to like see her dog and stuff. So I've always wanted to get one because of Chloe and now we have Rosie and also we have Charles, Taryn's dog. So like it is like puppy heaven here. Oh my God, look at the little, the paw. Oh. Ash, do you remember forever ago when Chloe would always knock over the trash can yeah. in our apartment? Yeah. We literally had to set up a camera to like catch her in the act. Oh my God, this is all we needed. <laughs> oh my God. I'm sure you guys have seen these because they're so popular. I feel like everyone has them except for me, but this is basically a camera so you can kind of like spy on your dog at any time, whether you're like leaving the house or if you're like us and we're just like upstairs and Chloe was down here, we can like low key spy on her. And then you can also talk to your dog and you can also throw them treats. I'm so shocked we haven't bought this ourselves. So shocked. This is like the perfect gift for any like dog lover. We should get one for mom and dad. Wait, this is like bougie. Like this is nice. Oh my God. I didn't expect it to be this like modern. Like yeah. it's cute. Do you know what I mean? Like it's very yeah, like very aesthetically cool. pleasing. Oh my God. Oh my God. This is where you put the treat. This is so cute. Whoever designed this. 10 out of 10. Doesn't even need batteries, it just plugs in, which is also really dope. You can do photos and videos, treat toss, and the two-way talk. Wait, we need treats, Ash. Can you get them? Oh my God, I'm stoked. There we go. Where should we put it? Okay, so this thing literally has HD video and night vision and a barking alert. So anytime your dog is barking, like it'll alert you on a notification on your phone, just like letting you know that something's up. Yo, this is insane. Okay, wait, so where should we put it? We need to put it in a spot where like they kind of hang out a lot. Okay, I ended up putting it here because both dogs normally kind of chill on these pink couches, when, couches, chairs, whenever we're not around. I mean, even Rosie is on it like right now. So I feel like this would be the perfect spot. Okay, so I'm just setting up the app. Is it green? Yes. Oh my god. I'm so excited. Okay, it's setting up right now. I thought it was also hilarious because literally the photo next to it is a photo of our family, me, Ash, and Chloe. <laughs> Chloe, we love you. I'm gonna move her spot and her bed kind of over there because then we can get like a good view. But literally, I still can't get over how cute this is. Also actually really excited for this on a real note just because Chloe has always struggled with separation anxiety. We honestly always felt bad because we didn't know like how to help or what to do other than play music while we're gone or like not make it a big deal when we come home or like little stuff like that. <laughs> Yeah, you're good. <laughs> I feel like she's just always struggled with it. I also know Remy's dog Daisy does too, and both of them are the same breed, so I don't know if it's a breed thing. And then Rosie, will you be in my vlog? <laughs> Let's be in, get better light. Teaching them young, get good light. Rosie, we actually haven't really talked about this too much, but as you guys know, basically we rescued her from having to go to a shelter, and she is the most loving thing ever. And it's actually really sad because basically the family that had her, they found her in a street when she was young, and she had all her puppies with her, or she was pregnant it was something like that so Rosie's very sensitive like if we were even to be like laughing really loud or something and like look at her really quick like sometimes she like cowards down 
honey, I was telling them about like her past. Aww. We haven't really talked about it. Yeah, she is literally the biggest snuggle bug. Like if you're sleeping, she has to be pressed against you. Not even just sleeping though. Like if you're just sitting, if you're working anywhere, if she's not like Chloe where she'll go lay hey, in her Chloe. bed. She has to lay like Maybe. right on top of you. She does not like being by herself. Well, I don't think she was treated the best at one point because she flinches a lot. No, that's what I was saying. Like whoever initially had her, obviously they left her like in the street with puppies. It's really sad. And then there's this spoiled little brat. So <laughs> both of them just don't like being alone for different reasons. I'm actually really excited because I think it's gonna help them. They're like we can talk it. to them when we're gone, Ash. I wanna like test it out. We should like go upstairs or like go in the garage yeah. and then just like, yeah, like pretend like, we're like pretend. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god, this setup is complete. Oh my god, I hear me. Be careful not to scare your dog. Avoid hitting him or her when tossing treats. Wait, Ash, this is dope. Wait, can you help me? We need to get them like over where their spot is. Oh, <laughs> this is so dope. I'm gonna throw a treat. Guys, please don't mind my ratchet nail. Do you see how it's broke? Oh my god. Oh no. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Look at. I literally went right to her. Oh, <laughs> lady, lady. oh my god! Wait, she got one! Oh my god, was that yummy? Ready to go? <gasps> go get it! Go get the treat! Yeah! Good girl! <laughs> was that yummy? Oh my god, I see me. That's so fun. The quality's so good. You have to get mom and dad one. Yeah, they would love it. We're a big dog family. Yeah, we love it. Rosie's wagging her tail. Yeah. Wait, wait, I'm gonna go upstairs. On your spot. Good girl. Hi, Chloe. This is like smart house. Oh my god, it's so dope. It is? Yeah. Chloe May. You have to press it to talk. Chloe May. <gasps> Good girl. And then to hear, you have to press it. You can literally take photos and then you can screen record. <gasps> it threw it, it literally threw it. Chloe May, come get the treat. Yay, good girl. Good girl. Oh my God, she's living right now. I'm gonna take a photo. This is the cutest thing I've ever seen. It's I so really wanna cool. get my parents one. Literally, Furbo, thank you for sending this. I'm not even kidding. I'm having way too much fun. I'm just gonna spy on my dogs all the time. I love it. I can see you guys so clear. Like, so, can you hear me easy? Like, is the audio good? Yeah. yeah. Really good. If dog people know, they just know. Oh my god, I'm sorry. No more. <laughs> it's under Chloe. Get it, Chloe? Do you like that? Did you like that? Oh my god, yay. The quality is yeah. so good. Oh my god. I think it'll be really good too, like, just so they don't get bored. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> So as you guys can see, the treats just come out right there. The camera's right here. And also, this is so durable. Like, even if you have a big dog that likes chewing on things, like, this thing is freaking strong. Like, you do not have to worry about it. Chloe, are you looking for treats? Where are they? She was just sniffing up here. So obviously, it's really cool because it throws out treats, but it actually does so much more than that. A really cool feature it has is its Furbo dog nanny. So even if you're gone and your dog is barking like crazy and something's going on or something's wrong or whatever, you actually get notifications on your phone through the app saying that your dog is barking and it, like, kind of lets you know that you should check in on them. It's almost like having a baby cam, like a nanny cam, but like for your dog or like a dog sitter at your house. I love that it's not just like a treat feature. I love that it really is about like making sure your dog is okay and safe and home and happy and not stressed. And I just feel like it's a really good all-in-one dog product. You always wonder what it's like for your dog when you're gone. So I feel like it'll be really cool to just kind of like have peace of mind, knowing that they're okay, being able to check in on them. So I'm so excited. If you guys have ever considered getting one, seriously, I'm not even just saying this, even though yes, they are sponsoring this. I think this is the best thing ever. It would be the perfect freaking gift for any dog or animal lover. So I'm gonna have the link in the description box. Seriously, go buy it. Also, I'm sorry, but how cute is it when Rosie sits like this? Her little arms. We've also officially given Rosie a middle name. It is Rosie Ray. <laughs> <laughs> because Chloe May because and Rosie Ray. Ray. Obviously, we named her after Addison Ray. <laughs> Obviously. Rosie Ray, Roro for short. Can I have access to the Furbo cam so I can watch the dogs um, when duh. I'm at my house? Oh duh. My God, duh. Charlie. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's his turn. You want to make sure you guys have it at like this is the perfect height for it. Like a little over like 12 to 20 inches ish, just because you want it to be able to throw out the treat, but not hit them or anything like that. And then not obviously too low, but not too high. Like just right. <laughs> oh, Charlie, get the treat. <laughs> Yay. 
also on a real note, the only thing keeping me sane during this whole quarantine situation is the dogs. Like I am so grateful that we got Rosie like right before this. We kind of like stole her from our parents because we didn't know who was gonna have like custody over her. We thought we were just gonna share. Also my last vlog that I did was like a personal favorites video, but I kind of want to do like a dog favorites. I feel like I have a lot of random stuff that I've been loving for the dogs that like, we should freaking talk about. I think it's a given. I know I just got it, but obviously the Furbo is definitely a freaking favorite. Obsessed. Okay, the next favorite I was pulling out to show you guys and Chloe got on it and it's so cute and pure. Okay, so I got this dog bed for a few different reasons. One, because it's really freaking cute. Two, it's also supposed to help with dogs with anxiety and Chloe loves it. Like at first I wasn't sure if she liked it. She's in it all the time. Rosie also loves this. Charles also loves this. Like it's just, it's so cute. Also guys, she needs a bath real bad, so please please do not mind that. But I got the light one. It's so like just fluffy and soft. Also like I love how it's cute, you know? It goes with the home decor, obviously. So love that. Also I actually had a shoot the other day. Well, not the other day. It was like two weeks ago. Let's be real because we've been stuck at home all this whole time. But I had a shoot the other day that I brought Chloe to. It helps so much. Like she's really good with her spot. If you ever hear us say like, go to your spot. I brought this on set and it made her so much more calm because she gets kind of like overwhelmed with a lot of energy, like anything that's super loud or like people laughing really loud or screaming or anything so I just brought her a little spot and she was such a good girl I was like a proud mom she really likes it I feel like it's just nice anytime also my parents watch her we always like bring her spot that way she just feels comfortable and at home and safe so yeah I really really like that I think she really likes it too which makes me happy because I feel like there's so many things that you buy for dogs and they like don't like it but like the furbo this it's so clear that like they love it you know what I mean and then that makes your heart happy and you feel like a proud mom and you feel like they love you and it's just like it's a thing then I actually have mentioned so many times that I've been meaning to get Chloe's stairs and there was a few of you guys who sent me this link. So we ended up buying stairs and we've been trying to get the dogs to use them. Chloe's been out of all of them the hardest. <laughs> she just, she gets overwhelmed and stuff. But I wanna show them. Come in. Where do you want it? I think right there is fine. Oh my God, they're so cute. Come here. Come here. Good girl, good girl, good girl, good girl. Good girl. Good girl. No. Rosie. No, 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 no. Use this. Use this, Rosie. girl. Come here, Rue. Come down. She's like, no. She's like, I can't. <laughs> Oh my god, puppy party. Good, good doggy! <laughs> Wow, my heart is so full. You guys, I didn't even know that I needed three dogs in my life. What was it like being an only child, Chloe? I love how it's cute. And there's different heights for it too. We put it on like a solid medium one, but it's like super stable. I would like leave this up all the time, you know? You come on, come down. Hi. This way. Good boy, good boy. Chloe me. good girl, good girl. Obviously that is also a favorite. I'm glad it's worked out. Thank you everyone who sent me links. Get up, come on, good, good girl. girl. Hey, hey. <laughs> oh my god, Charlie, come here. Everyone love what? me. Charlie's good at it. He's so good. Chloe. My heart is full. <laughs> Told you, she has to be touching you all the time. She really does. <laughs> He's so stiff. My heart is full. <laughs> we're dog moms. Say yeah, hi. Should we go play? Come on. Update time. TK and I made dinner. Woo! Woo! Shout out Lady Gaga. The dogs are playing. We're about to eat. Very excited. We're having Ooh. wine tonight. I want to get TK's reaction of the nudes. Mm. She was like, I'm, can I pour my wine? <laughs> uh oh, Chloe. Chloe. Oh. <laughs> oh, beauty guru. I'm a vlogger now, ladies. Yeah, she is. Did she? Yes. I knew. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> you missed the whole thing. I missed the whole thing. I was looking at them. Dude, I knew because she was walking like this. Chloe pooped. Yes. We can cut all of this. <laughs> Which one of you are gonna sleep with me tonight? Hmm? I need to get at least one of you. It's a lot later. We had dinner. It was honestly very good. We ended up going in the jacuzzi for a little bit. I only put my feet in though. Gonna get ready for bed. Good night. Good night, guys. Good night, Lita. I'm like, I'm here too. <laughs> Just kidding. Good morning. Let's go. Night, TK. Night, Tabby. Yeah. Okay, so I thought I was going to bed and then I ended up sitting here for like 20 minutes trying to do some TikToks. So I took that as my cue as time to go to bed and stop doing this. So anyways, that's why I'm using the bomb lighting because I was like, you know what? If it's here, we might as well use it. Thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog. I will see you guys tomorrow, most likely with a new one. Illy, you're the best. Okay, bye.